and soul of the game is at the boxing voice. Ain't no other sight in the game to see the boxing voice. BoxingVoice.com live with Omar Super O Douglas at his media day preparing for his bout April 25th. Now, tell us how you felt today training. Uh, I felt good. Uh, I've been working hard. I mean, uh, everything everything's just been working great. Like, uh, I was in training camp like around March 5th preparing for a fight and uh, I've just been striving since then. And uh, I've been getting great work. Uh, Hammer Hake Lundy, Serrano, Jason Sosa, the best, the best I know in this area. So I'm, I'm feeling as though I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for the world. Now, how does sparring affect you? Sparring with those names you just mentioned, guys who are experienced and have been at the top level. Spar sparring has been great. Uh, you learn a lot from guys like that. Uh, and I look forward to going to the world class level. So I need to box people like that. The other guys don't really give me that too much work. So I need them guys to push me. They push me. Uh, every day I was getting up and running with them guys. They push me when I run. They push me when we do strength and conditioning. Uh, everything's just been great. I've just been working hard and I'm ready. Now you're 13 and 0 with 10 knockouts. Where do you feel like you're at in your career? How far are you from a serious challenge, possibly a, another title fight? Uh, I feel as though I feel as though I'm right there at the door. After this fight, I'll be kicking the door down. And I'm right there. I'm ready for big time TV, Spike TV. You know, I'm, I'm ready for all that. Who are some guys in your division that you're watching now that you're interested in possibly facing in the future? Right, uh, probably guys like any anybody in the super featherweight class. Uh, I'm ready. I'm ready to take. I'm ready to take that spot because uh, I feel as though I'm ready. Uh, it's been. I've been in this sport for 15 years. I only been pro for four, going on five. But I've been in the sport for 15 years, and I just been working hard. And all the guys now, I'm watching guys like Gary Russell win titles and stuff like that. It just inspires me to push and I've been working with Danny Garcia and seeing him achieve all his goals has just been inspired me to push and I'm right there at the door. What should the boxing fan, the, the boxing voice fans know about you? Uh, I'm, a, I'm a thinker. Uh, I'm aggressive but I'm also a thinker and I have very fast hands uh, but my, my strongest point is I can think, I can adjust to whatever the opponent may bring. Now watching you train today, you remind me a little bit of uh, you know Adrian Broner two three years ago. You know, I is it fair to say your style is you know an intelligent counterpuncher? Yes, I'm an intelligent counterpuncher. Uh, it's funny because I can turn it off and on well, as far as boxing. Uh, I like to counterpunch, but I can counterpunch going forward like Triple G, and I can use my boxing skills. Uh, you look like Adrian Broner out there. You know, use a jab, box, and you know control and control the ring, ring generalship. How big is it to be the main event of a card like April 25th? Uh, it's great. I mean, I've been waiting for this moment for a long time. Uh, for us boxing back at home at Dover, I feel as though I should have had that spot a long time ago. Uh, everything's just everything just been working out. I've been working hard, and it's been a long time coming. I just feel as though right now is my time, and I deserve it. Where do you feel like you're at in your career? You know, how close are you to being where you want to be? Uh, I'm like two steps away. I'll give myself two years. To be contending for a title, I mean, it's right now I'm 13 and 0. After this fight, I'll be 14 and 0, and I'm just gonna keep on pushing. I feel as though I'm ready to be a top prospect, and once I'm respected as a top prospect, then a contender, and then you know, in the future, I find myself being a world champion. Now, what can the boxing fans expect from you come April 25th? Uh, come April 25th, you can expect drama. You can expect to see me being there, be smart, ring savvy, all the things you expect from a future world champion. We appreciate your time and good luck to you April 25th. Omar Douglas.